first rule of reading high ignitability spark plugs is to look at the plugs together to compare and look for anomalies that might occur in just one cylinder. If one plug is discolored or has deposits, it could be symptomatic of a fuel injector problem, head gasket leak, or other issue confined to just one cylinder or a bank of cylinders. If you look at the firing end of a spark plug, typically a normal or good plug will be gray to light brown. The condition for these is typically it's operating optimally and doesn't need replacement. This is also true for high ignitability spark plugs, but some high ignitability spark plugs could have a reddish or like a faint yellow color on the insulator. This is typically caused by fuel additives added by the refiner or even the customer. Every time the spark plug fires, the plasma burns away a few molecules of the precious metal on the electrodes. Over time, this eats away the electrodes and rounds off the sharp edges. The erosion gradually increases the gap between the electrodes, which increases the firing voltage required to generate a spark. Eventually, the ignition system reaches a point where it fails to produce enough voltage and the plug misfires. For high ignitability spark plugs, erosion can't be measured. Yes, you can measure the gap with a feeler gauge, but the erosion on these plugs is much more subtle due to the hardness of the materials. As the center electrode erodes, it changes shape and becomes more rounded. This can change the voltages required to fire the spark plug. This is why it is essential to change a high ignitability spark plug according to the replacement interval. A dark color on the tips that will be either wet or dry, well, this indicates an overly rich condition or possibly a cold heat range spark plug. A possible vacuum leak, low compression, timing, or a large spark plug gap. With high ignitability spark plugs, they can show signs of rich conditions due to engine related issues. But conditions caused by too cold of a plug, in other words, it has the wrong heat range, are scarce in this field. High ignitability spark plugs dissipate heat and quench the heat in the electrodes different than a conventional plug. This is due to advanced insulator designs shell construction, and even the electro configuration. Attempting to use a hotter plug to cure a fouling problem might result in further drivability issues. The best practice is to resolve the issue with a rich lean fuel mixture and use the recommended high ignitability spark plugs from the NGK catalog. When spark plugs overheat, accumulating deposits on the insulator tip melt and give the insulator tip a glazed or glossy appearance. This usually indicates a condition where the fuel mixture is too lean under certain conditions. But in some cases, a high ignitability spark plug can experience overheating. This will generate a glazed or glossy appearance on the electrodes and also the insulator. This is not typically a sign a plug is too hot for the application. If you think the plug is incorrect, check the catalog. Overheating can also be caused by a spark plug that is improperly torqued, too tight, or even too loose. Melting, well, this is typically caused by overheating. On most plugs, you're going to see an electrode surface that's rather lustrous and even uneven in the shading. The melting point of nickel is approximately 2300 degrees Fahrenheit. For high ignitability spark plugs, well, these precious metals have a higher melting point than the nickel alloys. For example, platinum has a melting point of 3,200 degrees Fahrenheit. Iridium and ruthenium have a melting point far above 4,200 degrees Fahrenheit. This allows high ignitability spark plugs to withstand extreme conditions inside a modern combustion chamber. The accumulations or deposits on the firing end is influenced by oil leakage, fuel quality, and even the engine's operating duration. High ignitability spark plugs can show signs of deposits on the electrodes and insulator. If more than one spark plug shows these signs, it is recommended to perform an oil consumption and compression check. Also, confirm the type of oil used by the customer. Often a customer, they may go for a CJ or CK diesel motor oil that may be cheaper, but it's going to leave deposits on the spark plug 
for gasoline engines. Corona stains are caused by a high amount of static electricity attracting particles of oil and dirt to the body of the plug. Reading spark plugs, well, it's not a lost art. You can still diagnose the condition of the engine, but with high ignitability spark plugs, you may want to pull more than one spark plug because inspection is critical. I'm Andrew Martell. Thank you very much.